What's up YouTube? Casual Yugi stuff back bringing you guys another Yu-Gi-Oh opening video. Of course, we're back opening some Yu-Gi-Oh Zexal today. Yu-Gi-Oh Zexal Galactic Overlord First Edition Booster Box is what we'll be cracking today. So if you're excited for the video, please smash the thumbs up button, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and turn on the notification bell to be notified with all of my future videos and future openings, future mail days, whatever we are uploading. And for the video guys, if we get 98 likes, I'll be giving away these two cards, a foreign French uh, Mazera de Ville and a Spanish Ultimate Rare um, Protection Zone A uh, Trap Disposal Unit. So two cards, a secret from ASD and a Rise of Destiny Ultimate Rare. They are foreign, but still cool pieces. This one's like played and this one's like near mint, so pretty cool. Uh, cards that we'll be giving away in the video guys 98 likes. I know you can do it You've always killed it with the like buttons and I'm very grateful for all the love and support on my channel So keep it up all right guys. This box is Galactic Overlord. It is the I believe fourth or fifth box in the Yu-Gi-Oh! Zexal series um, I personally love Yu-Gi-Oh! Zexal. I think it's a really really underrated um, Show I think the characters are really cool. I do love Kite uh, He's a fantastic protagonist in the uh, series and he's just actually a really, really good character, um, and it's really, really good fun to to watch. Um, yeah, as well as you know, Yuma and all the other number cards, and the fact that you know Astral is in there as well, is a really, really good and fun time. So, uh, in the box, there's some cool cards. Uh, you can obviously get the Neo Galaxy Eyes Ghost Rare, Ultimate Rare, or Ultra Rare. Then there's some cool secrets in here. You've got cards like Number Seven, the Luck Chance card, which is pretty cool. Can't remember its exact name. Then you've also got um, a card. Cardi as well. Got some other ultimates in here. You've got like uh, Big Eye. I think it's what, number eight. Big Eye, I think, or number nine. Then you've got uh, cars like Shark Drake, um, Vice. Yeah, Shark Drake, Vice is in here. Then you've also got cars like Force Focus, which is a quite cool card. And uh, yeah, some other nice cars. Like yeah, it's just gonna be a good time. And we're gonna crack open the box for you guys viewing at home and yeah galactic overlord boxes are actually quite expensive now um they're ranging to upwards of a hundred dollars each um you know when these are only about 40 bucks when they came out so yeah quite an expensive box guys so i hope you enjoy you guys excel yeah, and this box had a kind of messed up um seal here i don't really know what's happened it's like double loop so it's really loose and i was like this box is asking to be opened and of course on my channel we had to open it so without further ado I think that was good enough. Yes, it was. Crack open our box. There we go. Galactic Overlord. So 24 packs, first edition. Here goes, guys. Beautiful. Look at that. So we'll put our beautiful box out of the way there, shall we? That'll do. Perfect. And we'll start with, should we start with the left hand side of the box? I think we shall. Start by cracking open the first pack on the left hand side. Let's get a whiff of Galactic Overlord. Such a beautiful artwork of the Neo Galaxy Eyes. Ooh, beautiful smell, which is the equivalent of Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon um, for Zexal. Which is sweet, so first pack. Blade Bouncer, this card is again a familiar one from the series. You've got the Heratic cards in here as well. Which are cool, Bright Star Dragon, That Wacky Magic, and Hammer Shark um, for the first rare. There might be some good commons in here, but um, as I say, I wasn't playing at the time, so I don't know what is good out of the um, commons or what is short printed. I didn't look on uh, TCG Player before I started opening. But let's see Flame Tiger, um, Moonlight Papillon, XYZ Wrath, Overlay Owl, Yuma uses that a lot. Dimension Slice and Double Payback. Heratic Dragon again and Phantom Bouncer. Yeah, all these Bouncer cards are used by the uh, evil guy who's working for Mr. Heartland in uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Zexal. I want to try and keep it to no spoilers. I always tend to recall uh, stories from Yu-Gi-Oh! Zexal. Uh, ooh, Lady of D. That's pretty cool. That you guys, I don't want to spoil it for you, so I'm not going to mention any of the characters, what cards they use, or anything, because I want you to go and watch Yu-Gi-Oh! Zexal. Of course, um, which is a beautiful show, like I was saying. Alright, down to the fourth pack already. So here we go Butter, sorry, Berserk Scales, 
Mini Guts, Return, Blade Bouncer, and a... What the hell is that called? I can't even read that. Insecta Crossbow. Oh, here we go. Number 32, Shark Drake Vice. So, a card that I was talking about, we packed in Ultra Rare. Very nice. Number 32. That's a sweet card. We'll sleeve up our number 32. This would make a nice ultimate, um, for sure, but we're happy with an Ultra. It's not too bad, not too shabby. We'll put that down. And we'll keep going, guys. So, a very fun set to open. Right, so a Watt uh, Tail Dragon, Evil Light Lego Show, Berserk Scales, Overlay Owl, Rocket Arrow Express with 5,000 attack. I've seen this card before. Ooh, and a Fleffle. Fleff? Fleff? FL Elf. FL Elf. Never seen that card before. Cool. Then we got a Heretic Seal um, Dragon. And we'll sleeve up our Elf. Sorry, FL Elf. Fleff? Don't know how to pronounce that. It's funny card. Alright guys, let's keep moving on with the next pack. I hope you're well everybody. I hope you are having a good time wherever you are, whether you're at home, whether you're com commuting to work, or whether you are... Oh, I thought that was something good because I saw the um, XYZ. Whether you're uh, yeah on, on lunch break at the moment, or whether you're about to go to sleep, whether you're aware... Then let me know where you are when you're opening this video guys, in the comment section below for the giveaway. Obviously, I'll choose one lucky winner. Overlay Owl, Doom Donuts, Insect of Firefly. Ooh, hello. Insect of Firefly, back to back. Light Ray Diablos. That's pretty cool. That's, um... Sorry, that was really weird that we got two of the same card, but... Um, Light Ray Diablos reminds me of um, Diablos King of the Abyss from Force of the Breaker. That's a really cool rare. Let's put that one down. I like that. That's cool. Here we go for a Galactic Overlord pack again. We're feeling like an overlord today. We're going to be cracking open a lot of packs. That wacky magic. Morpho Butterspree, Commander of Swords, Lady of D, Heretic Seal of Vanishment, and Falling Current. Um, this is used by... I'm not going to tell you because I want you to watch it, but I think that was used by uh, Shark's um, relative. I'm not giving any spoilers at all for the show. I'm trying to keep it to the minimum. So, Blade Bowser, Flame Tiger, Moonlight Papillon, XYZ Wrath, Hieratic Seal of something, I can't read the full name, Evil Saw Darwino, that's pretty cool. Yep, nothing out of that one, unfortunately. Three packs to go for the left hand side, we've got a Super and an Ultra so far. I think you're due about 7 8 hollows per box. Hieratic Dragon of Nuit, Nitwit Outwit, Butterfly Oak. Evil White Lagushko, Insecta Giga Cricket, and a Hieratic Dragon of Atum. Nice. Nice, nice indeed. It's a beautiful looking super. We'll sleeve that up with our soft sleeves, of course. Nice. Hieratic Dragon, King of Atum. 2400, 6 overlay, and 2 level 6 dragon type monsters. Standard for those dragon archetypes. Cool. Right, so. Second to last pack, the left hand side. Okay. It's got to the stage where I'm throwing packs on the floor. <laughs> Heartache Dragon of Nebeth, uh, Berserk Scales, Mini Guts, Return, Gagaga -ga -ga Gardener, and Overlay Eater. Nope, nothing. Uh, that one. Whew. Right, moving on to the next pack. Okie dokie, we have a Aquamira Cycle, Morpho Butter Fly. Lady of D, Insecta Earwig, Light Warrior, Greffa, and a Bootum. It's <laughs> a pretty cute card. Oink, oink. Little piggy. It's cool. Uh, yeah, down to the right hand side of the box now. Look at that beautiful pink of the. Look at that stack of pink, guys. Beautiful thing, isn't it? Okay, start from the bottom of the packs. Okay, so we have a Doom Donuts. Insecta Firefly, What Tail Dragon, Evil Light Lagushko, and Heretic Seal of Banishment, and a Spiritual Light Art Hiriji. Cool. So, we've got another super. Very, very cool. We've got a lot of little super rare. Fantastic. Shall I sleeve that up? Put it down. I'd love to get, honestly, an, an Ultimate Rare Neo Galaxy Eyes, or obviously Ghost Rare, but 
I'm not sure how probable that will be. Okay, I think we've got... Okay, here goes our ulti, guys. Here is our ulti. Absorbing Jar. Pretty cool rare. Here goes our ultimate rare, guys. What is it? It is a Beatron. Don't think that's a good one, unfortunately. Beatron, but it's an ultimate rare nonetheless. Um... Wait a minute, is this... You can send one face up a spell trap card you control to the graveyard. Target one level 4 or lower insect type monster in your graveyard. Special summon it in face up defense position. You can only use the effect of Beatron once per turn. It's a cool looking ulti. It's an insect ulti. This is one which off the bat I wouldn't have said that I wanted. But hey, it's an ultimate rare nonetheless. We're still due a secret rare I think, so... Maybe we can turn it around with a nice expensive juicy secret. Remember, the secret I said that I wanted was number 7. So let's see what we can do. Whew. 10 minutes or just above into the video. Evo diversity. Oh, Photon Strike Bouncer. Nice. So back to back, ulti and secret Photon Strike Bouncer. Not a bad one. Pretty cool. I remember when um, the character who uses this summons it in the anime. And uh, look at that, guys. Really cool. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a fun moment when it was summoned. Yeah, it's a powerful card. Very, very powerful. So, just leave that up, put it with our pulls, very, very nice. We'll keep going because we still got, I think, uh, we've got three back-to-back -back hollows and we've got a secret and an ultimate back-to-back, -back. so overlay Owl, Insectors, Storm, Ancient Dragon, that's a nice rare, I'll put that down, and Light Ray Deadless as well, that's a cool common, I'll put that there as well, because Light Ray um, Diablos, Light, Light Ray Deadless, then we've got the um, uh, Warrior Digrepha version of that as well. I won't destroy this pack. Okay. Oops. Okay, Lady of D again. Wink wink. Lady of D, Doom Donuts, Blade Bouncer, Hieratic Dragon, Evo Price. Evo Price? Evo Price. Yeah. Okay, a few more packs to go. Galactic Overlord. Again guys, this is a set that you don't really see being open much recently. Um because no one's well opening these these kind of cool Zexal packs, you know, Insector Giga Cricket, ooh, Shining Elf, another Elf card, we've got El F Fell Elf and then Shining Elf, nice, beautiful hollow on these cards, really, really nice, Elf Elf, put that down, keep going with our pack opening, baby! Bright Star Dragon, That Wacky Magic, uh, Evil Light Legosaur, Commander of Swords, Light Ray Grepper, here we go. May as well put that down, Light Ray. We were just talking about him. And Red Headed Oni. Part of the Ushi Oni archetype. It's not really an archetype, is it? It's a McDonald's promo Ushi Oni, which was famous from Forbidden Memories. Then you got uh, the Ushi Oni, which is used by. Uh, Tanner in Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds in the uh, in the facility. All right, guys, five more packs. Sorry, sorry, four more packs. Let's see. Oh god, I'm destroying these packs. Okay, What Tail Dragon, X Y Z Wrath, Overlay Owl, Insector Earwig, Rocket Arrow Express, and another Beatron. Oh, okay, so our ultra, our two ultras were the same as uh, ultra was the same as our ultimate. That's no good. Ah, what can you do? Beatron. I mean, it may, be a, it may be a good card, I don't know, but I don't think it is. Like, when I was looking at the prices on TC TCG Player before opening the video, I did not see this one higher up, unfortunately. But things might change, you never know, insects might get some support, so... Oh, that's unfortunate. But who knows, maybe we can still get another secret or another ultimate, I don't know. We'll see. Berserk Scales, Aqua Mirror Cycle, Lady of D, no, nothing like that one. Two more packs to go. Two more packets, guys. It smells good. Bay Blade Bowser, Storm, Insect of Firefly, Butterfly Oak, Dimensional Slice, and Hieratic Seal of Reflection. Nice. Nice trap card. Just leave that up. Got quite a few hollows, but not amazing ones. Like, we got a good secret rare, but we didn't get a, a nice ultra. Or what was our other ultra? Shark Drake. Yeah, not too bad. It's been an okay box. Nothing special, nothing great. But what can you do? Insect Earwig, Pyratic Dragon, Nitwit Outwit, Butterfly Oak, Gagaga Gardener, and just a rare in the last pack. 
but not to worry guys, that was a fun opening. Let's just review our pulls for Galactic Overlord. Cool box. We managed to get, let's just review our hollows. We got 10 hollows. We got a Fell Elf, number 32 Shark Drake Ultra, Hieratic Dragon King of Atum, a Photon Strike Bouncer, that's probably my favourite card, with our Beatron Ultimate. Uh, Spring Light Art, uh, Beatron again, Shining Elf and Heretic Seal. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We've got 9 hollows. These are probably the highlight for me, the secret and the ultimate. Um, it was an okay opening, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. That was my first ever box of Galactic Overlord open in my life, and I'm just glad to share it with you on the channel. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Remember, for the giveaway, which is these two cards right here, if you can smash the like button 98 times, I'll be giving them away to one lucky comment. So leave a comment down below. And as per usual, guys, keep it casual on anything that you do. And I hope you enjoyed the video. This was uh, Mr. Kajugi Stuff signing off. And I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace and bye for now.